Hey, it's Ross here. Um, I'm gonna show you a short video on how to import your contacts into Palmtree. So firstly, log into Palmtree and then access the contacts tab. Once on here, you'll see there's an import button on the top right. If you click that, I'll just tick this box. Oh, firstly, I need to download the template in which to um, copy my contacts across. So I'll download that now. There we go, we can see that's down there. So I'll click on that, which will open it up. Okay, so there, there's my, this is my template. And then I'll open up my contacts from, let me see, okay, let me just close this one down. Don't need that. Okay, so this is the, the um, downloaded template I've just um, downloaded. And if I go to some um, dummy data I've got here, this dummy data is in the format of how your LinkedIn data would look if exported. So let me just pull that to the side there so we can see what I'm doing side by side. Okay, so as you can see in your import, you can um, import the first name, the surname, their occupation, phone number and email address. So what all I do here is I want the first name and surname. They're both in, in columns next to each other here. So I can basically copy them all together first and second, so I just highlight them all, click copy, go over here, and I will paste, and that puts in the first name and the surname. And then the occupation is over here under position in LinkedIn, so I'll just um, copy that, and then paste that in here. And then phone number is not provided on LinkedIn, but email address is, so I'll just copy that, and paste that in there. There we go. Just... There we go. So now all I do is I save this and then I, oh, that's fine. Let me just save that template. Yep, save. Okay, but now what I need to do is export it. Um, depending on whether you're using Microsoft Excel or Apple um, Numbers, what you need to do is you need to export the file or save the file as a CSV file. So on Windows, it would be save as CSV. On Numbers, it's export to CSV. So I'll just save that in the downloads folder. Doesn't matter where you save it, as long as you know. Then I click here, I want to import. I'm just ticking this box to confirm that I've, um, I've got permission to use this data. And then I'll select it here. It's the CSV file that I want. So click that, open, we can see Success, contacts imported, all 16. So if I go to my contacts now and scroll down, we will see, here we go, all of my test data is in here. So that's really as simple as it is. If you have any errors in your data, where it said success, it will also tell you um, how many were unsuccessful and allow you to download and export of any unsuccessful um, contacts so you know which ones have not been imported. So that, it's as simple as that. That is how you import data into Palm Tree.